Hello, I'm Kent Weens, owner of Weens Lawn Care in Parker, Colorado, with a tip for you on aerating your lawn. Here in uh, the Denver, Colorado area, we have very poor soils, a lot of clay and sandy soils, and that's one reason that you need to aerate your lawn uh, at least twice a year, uh, once in the spring and once in the fall is for soil compaction uh, especially the clay tends to get very hard packed and makes it very difficult for the roots of the lawn to uh, penetrate down deep uh, to be healthy for the uh, lawn that's above ground you need healthy roots down below ground so uh, aeration is important to basically poke holes in the lawn to allow the air, water, and nutrients to uh, get down to the roots of the turf where it's needed. Uh, another reason <coughs> for aerating is uh, to reduce the thatch buildup, the thatch layer, which is down in the root zone, not on the surface of the lawn like a lot of people think. All that's on the surface of your lawn is dead grass, and I do not recommend power raking. You can get away with it if you do it uh, while the lawn is dormant before it's greened up, but all it'll do is uh, the same thing as raking by hand is uh, pick up the dead stuff on the surface, which is actually beneficial for the lawn. So you, you don't want to rake up the dead grass. You want it to go back down into the soil to decompose and go back down into the soil, which helps uh, get some organic activity. Uh, microbial activity going in the soil which uh, is healthy for your lawn uh, because like I say we just have horrible soils here in the Denver Colorado metro area so whatever you can do to help uh, enrich that soil basically uh, revive uh, is, a, is a good um, nutrient uh, it doesn't take the place of fertilizer but it helps the water penetrate the soil and soak down into it and has some iron in it as well which helps the color uh, some of the organic fertilizers uh, help getting a little uh, organic activity and enriching the soil help your lawn look better that's actually one of the best things you can do for your lawn but it does need the uh, uh, nitrogen fertilizer as well just to help it grow and and uh, for overall health and vigor uh, so there's there's two reasons that you aerate. One is for soil compaction. The other is to uh, reduce the thatch layer, which is down in the root zone. Um, and aeration helps to alleviate that. The the newer lawns, I say newer, I mean like 10 years old and younger. The newly seeded lawns, you'll feel when you walk on them, they're kind of spongy, like carpeting. That's because they have a heavy thatch layer. They haven't had time to. Uh, build up this uh, organic activity in the soil which uh, you know decomposes the the thatch in the root zone uh, the older lawns like a 30 year old lawn you, you can you know separate the grass blades and look down in you'll see soil and they'll feel hard as a rock when you walk on them. they're the ones that get compacted and need uh, aeration to, re to alleviate soil compaction but the ones that feel spongy that's because they have a heavy thatch layer and uh, they need at least twice a year even three times a year would be a good thing if you've got a, a lawn that feels real spongy when you walk on it and uh, the reason a, a heavy thatch layer is not good uh, the, the water tends to just pool on the surface and not soak down in which uh, creates humidity which makes your lawn susceptible to attack from disease uh, heavy thatch layer also makes it susceptible to attack from insects because it's just not going to be healthy because the water air and nutrients is not getting down to the roots where it needs to be so those are some of the reasons that uh, aeration is very very important to do at least uh, twice a year on your lawn especially here in the Denver Colorado metro area and that's my tip for your lawn for more lawn tips, please visit my website at www.weanslawncare.vpweb.com or you can call me 303-805-1192 uh, and leave a message or my cell phone 303-358-0041 or my email is kentweans, that's W-I-E-N-S 
at msn.com. Thank you.